Oh, welcome back. It's Mallet, and uh, working on the big city again. Today, continue to work on our downtown area. Uh, but in case you were wondering, here's the airport. We'll obviously come back to that in due time. And, well, obviously something went wrong. <laughs> uh, yeah, looks like we have some issues. Looks like we do have the whole map now. Yes, we have most of the map. So yeah, we, I guess we should probably fix our airport. We have had a couple little issues here and there, but This allows us to now make a bigger airport. Wish we could make that brush a little bigger. Well, I didn't I didn't anticipate any issues with the airport, so I guess I gotta read. Rezone the airport district. I think that has something to do with 80. I, I think I had 81 tiles fixed. And I had it fixed for the other city. And I didn't think it was going to affect us here. And I previously did open it up to see how we were doing. I must have... Uh, not checked all the things I needed to check, so I apologize. So we did get 81 tiles redid working, so we'll be able to be on the hunt for even an even bigger city, I believe. All that should disappear. Airport's back in business. Hey, Soba. I don't know how to say it. I'll have to look at the channel. I'm, thanks for coming back again. I really like the style of what you're doing on, on yours. It's pretty cool. I'm just a, I'm just a big hack. <clears throat> so maybe you like my air museum. We lost a couple trees. We'll come back. Shukaboa, yeah, <laughs> get got a, quite a bit of flair going on on your videos. I like the uh, the new one. Very nice. It's amazing how many people are out there doing city skylines, and <clears throat> it's nice when you get exposed to some different ones. You, I don't know if you ever watched Do Not Eat, which is uh, uh, he did a lot of stuff with Bisco. Bisquahaven, Bisquite, you know, you know what I'm talking about, Bisque. I've got his tower in here now. I, I can't, I can never say his name. But they did that nice Jefferson Cities thing. My niche is, uh, I just like to build and I'm trying to make it, things better as they are. But we've got quite a big city here. We learned how to do green districts. I wanted to unlock more unique factories so I could use them more. I haven't been able to find that. Yeah, the Franklin series was good. I mean, a lot of that is a uh, pretty good truth with the highways and stuff like that. I probably don't agree with do not eat politically, and probably don't agree politically with a lot of the big streamers. But I do know I do know that there's some some truth stuff with that. What happened to my park? Maybe my park. Did but I, I understand how the politics affect city design. There, we got our park back. Bisquil housing. Okay, good. Thank you. I should save that. 
write that down because I like his I like his work a lot. I followed him a lot. But yeah. I really like the do not eat uh I really like his stuff. So nice, so well done. Well, we are in the process of making our cities and ports better. We revamped this port. Yeah, it's not a it's a hard name. <laughs> So this is our, our new port facility. We moved our our uh, tur turboats, cruise ships over to here. Ran the tram down into here. And we're gonna work, we'll make this a little bit more of a, a little small entertainment district, but we've got over 100,000 people, a pretty, pretty wide range of districts last couple streams on here we built a new highway to go down to this uh, other shore watching city planner plays and i learned how to make the farms better so that's a good thing <laughs> so we'll, we're going to get some more decals and farm production in there uh, gonna it's in the future here we do our ore our ore quarry because uh, on my other series Riverton I did a I did a different did a different thing so I think that turned out well take care of the Russian bot we've got our university Freddie Primo University is named after a, a guy I knew he uh he recently passed away suddenly and uh I figured I'd name the the university after him. I'm st I still need to work on getting parking lots right. That's kind of a bad parking lot, but yeah, you know. I put the Civil Aviation Club over here. I basically did the airports like it was an older airport, and then a bigger one. But now, you know, we we got a lot of land to play with yeah freddie i think had a little a few issues but he was a, he was a decent guy he 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 often questioned my my wearing of socks with sandals but i pretty much did that just to troll him on twitter but i would like to come through and start to redo this downtown i want to put a big uh so we're gonna do we're gonna do the old pause and see, I want to start with a better transit center. We need a better hospital. This all kind of came in and grew and, you know, this train line needs to be improved. There's a possibility, I think, that this stuff could go underground. I don't know. I think we just need to, need to make it better. I'm okay with this side right here. And I'm pretty much okay with this. And then it kind of zones down. But I really want to do kind of this I'm okay with. Some of this needs to be toned down. <clears throat> but we need to work on this area. So one of the first things I want to do is check out the transit hubs. I think I want to do, I want to put this, I want to put that sunken. Sunken Transit Hub in. And there's a couple of them. Yeah, because we want to put the Metro. I was thinking about doing like a crossover train. Hey, David, how are you? So I was thinking... We've got a crossover train that that's the train station but I'd like to do I think we, we need a sunken platform metro station I know there's that other there's another one the sunken train station 
I've got the metric. Maybe I gotta go back. Let's go back. Go under trains. Hmm. You know, I purposely. Ah, this one. Metro. Oh, that's a met. It's a metro plaza. I I like that. <clears throat> Kind of a big train fan too. Elevated dual island platform train station. Oh. So we could probably do. I kind of want to use that. I, I really like how that looks in there. Maybe we could do. Well, let's kind of let's play with this over here if we don't if you guys don't mind we'll go in the nether world here and see what things look like that's the sunken one this is our base already occupied that's our train. That's like the over, Overland train station. Probably just do a video on uh, what different train stations look like. I kind of like this one too. Oh, that does look like I'm being placed road. I get a couple weird things where it doesn't want to place roadside. I wouldn't mind one of those. I like that. That is that a train station? Metro sunken bypass metro. So you get to. I think I think that would look uh, pretty nice in our city. I like that. Oh, it's really stuck to that road there, isn't it? Oh, Elizabeth. Oh, very cool. I was I was actually kind of curious. I didn't I didn't look in deep in depth but where you were from. But uh enjoy yourself and have a good dinner. Thanks for coming by again. I appreciate it. Ate logo? Okay. I made that sound so bad. I think we need this train station. And we probably put it in conjunction with that somehow. That's what we're gonna do. Let's go back downtown and do some redevelopment. Maybe, maybe. Redevelopment. What do we do, redevelopment? I think. We have a lot of, uh, a lot of things in here, but I think we're going to go and do a full scale change here I'm just gonna do it be done oh you guys are gonna talk different languages i'm not even gonna know thank you thank you but we do need to go that's part of our metro i think it is yeah Part of the metro line. We can back that up a little bit there. <laughs> I'll need a, a book now. A 
So we're going to have a nice downtown. And we're going to start off by putting this metro down, down here. I think the metro should be. I think we've got our main our main road that comes through here. Hello, Victor. How are you today? We're streaming again. Do we think maybe a... Look at that. That's bumpy, isn't it? Yeah, we all know that this downtown needed to be... Oh, nice. We're going to take these tracks back here. Oh, look at that. We destroyed all that. That's okay. We, we, this is a work in progress. Live, horrible work in progress. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Well, you know, one of these days we're going to do disasters, right? Well, we'll have to come up with a, a reasoning why we would do that. Could put a little lake in there. I don't know if it's uh, acceptable here, but we might expand some of our land here. How do we do that? Give ourselves a little shelf of land down here. That way we have a little bit more river front. Let's, I think we're going to run, I think I want to run trams downtown. So we'll run a tram line out to here, right? And, and then we have this road that kind of connects to there. This is going to be a good time to, yeah, marina. Yeah, we can have a marina in here. So we'll probably have to put some fancy stuff down there. We have to make sure we r remember to run our tr train. Maybe we can run this train along there. I do want to put our... Metro. Also want to run this road out. What is in our way there? Maybe we have to destroy something. Got to be careful we don't lose. Well, for some reason, we, we, we got a crooked road there, but I guess that's... That happens, doesn't it? We can take this building here. And move it. Yeah, we'll just take that entire batch of stuff there. Ah, uh, I don't really want to do that.
That's much better. Excellent. Now let's upgrade that road. All right. Yeah, we can get a nice transit through there. That's, I believe that's good. We will be redoing some of these tracks. And you're going to get moved too. I apologize. I think we're going to run these trains differently. I think I'm going to run it down here. And along like this. No, okay, we're gonna need some land there. See, you could do this kind of stuff. Yeah, that looks perfect. Might make more sense, right? I don't know. All right, let's. We're going to go ahead with our metro building right here. Nice sunken plaza kind of thing. Yeah, I got most of my work done. It's Sunday. I usually try to just goof off on Sundays a little bit. Everyone's doing their thing right now, so I'll do my thing. Unique building. I spell that properly, it might be more helpful. So we got a really nice uh, big New York City building here. See if we can get that fit in here. Is there a road that goes with that? Ah, there are. Okay. Battery park. That's why. Maybe. That gives us a good reason to move that over a little bit. Get some roads downtown. I think we're going to have to move that back. We can do that, and then we can move it. Kind of straighten that out. There we go. That works. Works for me. Hope it works for everybody. Now, we were looking at that train station. I kind of really like that train station. We could take tracks that we have over here and just run these underground come on the 
it just looks I think it looks good there. Let's do that. We can always change it. Trains, trains, trains. There we go. Okay. I wanted to make sure it was technically going to do what I wanted it to do. <clears throat> down I hope it makes sense That's the commuter part. And we've got this train right here. My thought is it could go underneath this road area. Do we bring that down far enough? Bring that. <clears throat> that might work. I think that'll look pretty good right now. Now we have to figure out what we want to do with these train lines. Hmm. Well, let's try something and see how bad it looks. I don't know if I really want the train lines going through town like that. But I'm not against it. Could be fun. It could be ugly. I think it really needs to go down. Does it, I think we need to. I'm not against it. Why do I keep clicking the wrong button? I she need to come in from here. Yeah, it really, it really doesn't want to. <laughs> like, what are you trying to do here, son? Go straight in there. Now, we don't need to go underground. We're going to do this for a second. Get in here. I don't have a node there. That's what I thought. Just 
destroy that one. Come in. We'll make it as realistic as we can. It's an incline. Yeah, no. Sometimes things in city skylines. Sort of like science fiction. There's a a little suspension of disbelief, maybe. Now that can all be fixed. My main concern is just to get a semi-plausible connection through here. Because I really want to use that train station. I like it. And even though we'll get some freight trains coming through there, well, it could be fun. We'll, we're, we'll put something to guarantee other than freight trains. Look at that. We are. Well, we got, I think we got straight out. Yeah. Good. That works for me. We do have to bring that into the main line. Yeah, it is. Hey, Fina, how you doing? It's sort of, it's sometimes it's as hard as making scenic byways. Aha, that's not that good. But we're trying to make our our new downtown look pretty good. So if I start giving someone a seizure here, let me know. How's the uh, clavicle? Oh my God, I'm not doing this, am I? thing is just losing its mind on me. <laughs> well, we are forever now we have scenic byways as an expert badge for the channel. I don't think we can do it on a. Yeah, that'll look pretty bad, won't it? Now I think we can come back in with move it. Bring that down a little bit. I think we're okay here because no one in the chat has said what in the hell is wrong with you. Can't do that. All right, let's, uh, 
Oh yeah, I bet. Well, the trains decided to go in through there, so that's good. They didn't say, we're not going in your weird tunnel thing. So let's save the game. We did get the all tiles to unlock thing working, so we've got. As long as I can build on this city, we'll build on it. So I. I've got this in Riverton. We can switch off on. That's good. We got more fishing opportunities. If anyone knows how to unlock. The factories. Not that's not factories. I want to place multiple factories. And I. I thought I could do that. I thought I had that unlocked at one time, but if anyone, anyone knows that, put that in the chat, put it in a comment. But we're thinking that this is going to be our new downtown. Just make things. And this is our new downtown metro station. One of the things we need to do, go to our line, our, our transport lines overview. We're going to delete all of our, our public transport because it's, it's a mess. And we'll get some stuff built today. And I think tomorrow. We'll do a stream where we figure out our stuff. Tram line you gotta go to because you're probably okay, but you're probably in the way. Metro line will be fine. Oh yeah, it's it's a disaster. The only way to start out is do anything here is start over. Oh, walking tours. Ah, sightseeing bus. No. So, yeah. All of our public transport is now gone. <laughs> we can just build. I thought we'd do a kind of complicated. I don't want to be. I, I didn't really do them that well either, so that's fine. Because we did in, we did redo our, our oh you guys may not have seen this. I did I did some work offline. We have to re repaint that park. Park district. There. So what I did is I kind of re redid our our Interchange here. Which I'm going to take a picture. I'm kind of proud of that. It's not good, but I like it. And I made a park in there. Gave him some parking. Made the highway look better. I decided to put some school stuff over here. And I think we're going to put a couple other school stuff in here. And then we're going to reclaim the ore area. And then we're going to re relocate our manufacturing for ore. We'll probably probably get put in the... I'm, I'm not sure yet. But we have a lot more room. We can probably... We can move our ore stuff out of town. And then we can put some some nice low, low residential here. And then we can put one of our uh, wildlife reserve park things in here. So we've got... Plenty of fun to do there. <clears throat> but that's that's what I did. Okay. Maybe you didn't see, but I added more aircraft to the aircraft park. We're going to put more trees in there and some decoration. Yeah, we, we have cool planes on our airport. 
We got the constellation, Connie coming in. Connie coming in for passengers. That's a VIP. Making the props all weird. I have to work on something with that. Yeah, we we threw some. What? Is, let's do this. We're gonna look at the pronunciation that you cobble. Get him out of here. That Bisquell Hausen put in. We put some of his plane packs. And even I, I'm not even gonna try and say it because I'll get it wrong. Uh, we, we occasionally will have some F4s taken off from the field. So that's that. Go back to our downtown business. This is titled downtown. Yeah, the planes are nice. And I'll start putting links to some of the mods and stuff I have. i just kind of been lazy on that. Now we need to connect this up. Metro to the line. I did put a Metro here. We have to, very expensive metro. It is going underneath the, ocean. Oh, kind of wanted to go down deeper. That would look kind of cool in a way, but it's not what we I have no idea if I'm connecting to the down underground one. The the airport classic style. Now these are weird. Let's let's pretend that's connected properly if you would. Why did the city all hate themselves? Now we can for sure do one line for sure. Go here. And we can we can do a line here. To here, correct, and do, 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 to here. Look at that. That is one serious loop. I did that so we can add in other. Other things. Are you talking about the airport? I believe that's what you're talking about. Okay, we have transport. We have one line of transport, I would say. Metro. Metro line. So let's call that the airport. Port line. Call that green. 
we have people going into it. Now, we've got trains and metro. So if someone brings the metro to here and they want to take a train someplace, they have to, they have to get here someplace, right? So now we're going to go back to playing roads. We can just have like a bus that brings people from the metro to here. Or should we put a metro station? It'd kind of be stupid to put a metro station here, wouldn't it? I would think there is. I think that'd be stupid. Yeah, that'd be kind of dumb. We're also going to, we'll put a path. But a bus station. Inner city bus station. That's a nice bus depot. Could have done the elevated dual. I, I, anyway, let's do a bus station, a bus, bus line. And this is just a real simple bus line. That could be a, that could be tram too. Yeah, it probably would. Hey, Eric. Yeah, a nice, a nice path. Do a walking path. I am totally open to suggestions. See if we can get that to connect up. Do paths connect to that? No. I don't really see a path connection to it, do we? It's on the sidewalk, so if we're on the sidewalk... Should connect to it somehow. Yeah, I thought of a tram loop too. That was uh that was a good idea. I think that we could probably put both of them in there for future services. Let's just go ahead and upgrade that. I want the trees and stuff, but having that extra ability for town is nice. There. That's going to work. Yeah, let's just do the bus and tram loop. Start trying to put in some of our now, we got to put the tram.
Well, I guess it's going to be a mess no matter what, right? There. And I've never, I don't think I've ever been on a downtown tram. I live out in the sticks. <laughs> Let's look at our transport. <clears throat> Lines overview. Metro line and tr oh, we did a bus too, did we? Yeah, we did. Let's call that <clears throat> Metro Train Loop W D N T. And we're going to give that red. Oh, no. Yeah, I'm not sure how it totally connects. Or well, if we name them, then we're trams. Yeah, I, I kind of got that. We got it. Thinking our tram. We'll do like these things here. Kind of a, we'll do it a red. Give them red. I don't know why that bus is going there, but. There's no reason the train station can't be really cool to look out on the shipping. Like they said, you will get a lot of uh, parking. So downtown is probably a good place to put a parking garage. And it probably wouldn't hurt to just do it. Then we can figure out where we're going to put everything else. But we've kind of obstructed a lot of stuff here. I don't want to make it totally convenient. But we'll put it right in the middle. Because I think people like parking downtown. All right, we do need to continue this little road here. This was part of our our park development. So now we've got just a little loop of public transport taking care of people. Right? The buses go right in there too, so that's pretty nice. Now we got the trams coming. We'll probably end up putting less trams. And then we get freight trains that go right through town. So I think that's going to be kind of fun. Now, I want to do some development right down here. See if we can do this. This is going to be kind of a, I'd say kind of a, a fancy place to live in a way, maybe. Over on the on the dock, so we have to have big stuff. I'm gonna come in here and come here and build a road possibly. Trying to fit some roads inside of that. Yeah, it's kind of ugly, isn't it? All 
right, let's start with back here. That's better. And I, I hope everyone's having a good Sunday. I'm going to do my obligatory smash the like and uh, subscribe pitch, and now we're done. <laughs> what do these guys look like? Those are small. We need big buildings. Yeah, I like these. These are really nice looking. I really like the, the Brazilian combo condos pack. If we don't put them too close to each other. We can probably put a lot more than we have. Can we put one right there? No one really wants to be that close to the train, but we can put one. We have to let's put a smaller one there. Does, does somebody know how to change the direction? Are you asking, or if that's true, then let me know. We can easily show that. But the curvy part, you know, maybe we don't know how to do. Yeah, maybe we'll. You think these guys really want to live there? Probably not. We might get a. Yeah, I like these too. These are kind of nice too. Yeah, that's nice. Nice mix. Uh, if you're doing a one-way road, just in case you are asking, you just go back, place your road, and then right-click on it in the upgrade, and it'll change the direction of your road. Yeah, it's well-connected. I mean, we're going to have to put up... I want to do... Now that the city has really gotten pretty big and all that. We can start doing nicer stuff. See if we can do a path. Yeah, that'd probably be a good place for a bike path. I hope that answered your question. I don't think we're going to get a path. Righty click button, yes. Well, I don't think that's going to work. Yeah, we, we, we went past the 100K. We were up a little bit higher. We might be having trouble now because of what we're doing here. We're going to have to do shift P for anarchy for our plants. Uh, the live oaks and these purpley trees are my favorite now. See, they forgot to put one of those there. I think that's starting to look pretty good for for a little corner with a lot of train stuff in it.
That looks pretty good. Yeah, they're fun. Now we... Could we put something right here? What could we put there? We got commercial. We put a Hollywood video there. Or an old Burger King. Heavy commercial. I think that kind of blends in nice with everything. I am not unhappy with that. Oh, yeah, we have weird water stuff, don't we? There. Now it has water. Ooh. Uh, yeah. Ex yeah, you know about uh, Image Overlay 2, I think it is. And if you don't know, if you... If City Planner Plays did a really nice uh, Image Overlay build. And that's the only one that I've seen anyone do. I tried to do the City of Milwaukee once. comes a train. We got one of these trains coming in for her. We do have the Acellas. The only trains we get around here are coal trains and freight trains. Actually, I'm going to direct you to a different channel all the time, but City Planner Plays has a series where he did his latest series, not Verde Beach, but I think Tutoria, where he did change the season in the game. So he does have a video for that, and I, I don't have any really instructional videos. Otherwise, I'd point you to one of mine, but I've watched him and, like, Tup, Yumble, are some pretty good guys with how to do stuff. And Overcharged Egg... Has a lot of good stuff too. Now we can't neglect all the trees, right? We can bring some of these in here. This is obviously a nice little corner. We're going to just have a small corner of trees since we are downtown. The rest of that's going to have to go away. But I think here we're gonna get we're gonna see if we can find a un large, unique building of some sort. Because you know, real really large buildings just get like a whole city block, right? You don't. I like this one because it kind of looks a lot like these. That's pretty big. And it should be a pretty good centerpiece for it. Yeah, the game, the Redwoods. Yeah, the Redwoods are really good. You know, you forget how big buildings are. That'd be a nice place to have an office right there. Or, you know, a penthouse office skyscraper. So it's kind of a generic one. That's actually maybe a in-game generic one. I'm not sure. Company headquarters. Well, you need we need a company headquarters someplace around here. That's for the big wigs. Yeah, got a couple big wigs over here too. I think we're gonna run. I don't want to put too much in there. Let's see what our next building is. Oh, yeah, we got Eddie Cavango. That's kind of, it's not that big of a building, is it? You know, I'd like to put this building right here. It's too big. 
Yeah, you don't realize how big some of these buildings really are. Yeah, that was that one we had in there before. So it kind of gives some right in the middle. Like that. This might be good. Not along here. There. Kind of looking for stuff that will look good from far away. Oh, yeah, this is all part of our electric car building. What's that look like? That might be a nice building right there. Maybe not. We gotta put the colossal order one in, right? Let's put them right on the corner. Nice scale. Ooh, you know, we could put the... We already have a park in here, but this could, uh, this could be nice. I think right down here. Yeah. That'll help with the, the city. Couple parks right down there in this big open area. That might work. Oh, we've got a couple other buildings. I don't know what is here that it won't let it build. I'd be mad if I built a building and, and I couldn't see any out of it anymore. Yeah. We're not, this is not going to be as good as uh, Marcello's uh, New York City, but we're trying to put some big buildings in here. Wow, that's going to be a big one. Everybody likes that. Oh, the park will always be in shade now. I think we probably need a couple smaller ones. You know, that probably needs a better placement. But in the city-wise, it looks pretty good. We should probably do a crossroad here. Yeah, it, it, it's bigger than I thought it was going to be. We might have to relocate that a little bit. Come on. Well, we could probably do some decorating around it. Let's get the buildings in place first.
And then we'll do something like that. I think this road might be able to get there. No, it can't. No, I think it can. There. Gotta have roads around it. All right, what is next in our placement? I did get a bunch of unique buildings, so hopefully we can. Well, we could put a, an oppression office down here, right there. Oh, we need that library. Oh, the science center and the aquarium kind of things. Took some of that out. Services building, yeah, let's do that. Slope too steep. Can't believe we don't have a lot of room. High interest tower, that kind of... That's kind of a nice building for right there. Not bad. There's always got to be some smaller buildings. We're going to have to put in our an aquarium someplace. Actually, let's, let's see how badly... There are no... I guess we got to put Tim Hortons in. And, yeah, kind of like that. We can come in there with some trees. Rick, are you going to be streaming streaming your cities? You're going to build some cities for us with Canadian flair. Yeah, having the aquarium right downtown is going to be cool too. And then. can do some of the other unique buildings. The Science Center. I wonder where the Science Center is. Oh, I know what we can do. I think we can do this, maybe. Let's see. Oh, I know what. I know. I know. Do not have a Canadian truck convoy going on at this time. <laughs> there. Water for the aquarium. They are kind of... Uh... Uh, this is New Eden. I think that's the name of it. It's been heavily, heavily changed. Uh, let's see. We can save the game. It is New Eden. Well, it won't, it won't show it, but it's uh, it's got the same theme applied to it, or lot applied to it, that a Sanctum Gamer uses in his River Valley map. No, they don't. That's why we need a place to put the oppression office. So what I was thinking, no problem. Is we could come in here with the tram line again, right? Because we're all about trams today. We're going to do a little expansion of the land. Do a little bit more expansion here. 
because it's for science, we're going to be okay. Yeah, Eden Valley is the map. I think that's the name of it. Yes. So this will be our marina eventually. Oh, no, you have to stream it and fail. Not that I want you to fail, but there's nothing wrong with failing in the game when you're doing it. It's half the fun. And I bet fill them with water. So this is going to be our science center, right? So we're going to do something fun. Hopefully we'll get the buildings placed. We're going to just do a, a road around here. I guess there's probably going to be a tram road all the way around here. These tracks cannot bypass each other. Let's do this. I just thought of this. It's super cool. Yeah, well, if you go back on this series a little bit, we were down to 14% for a little while. That was fun. And that's where learning how to do the uh, traffic management comes in handy. That's when you, you watch all the videos on traffic management. And you think to yourself, is this really what I should be doing? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure if these roads are going to stick like this, but we're going to find... Oh, I don't really want that one there. That one might work. So we'll get down here. Unclick on you. There. That's going to be nifty, nifty. So what I'm thinking, and this can be our science area, right? We, we can have the tram go through there. You know, people are going to come with their cars, too. I don't know how that's going to work, so we're going to go back to unique buildings. Put the science center down here. Is that not roadside? Is that? There. You know, I don't think there is a good necessarily a super good way of doing it. I have found that doing roundabouts like this really do help. But what I did, this is uh, a long time in the, in the making. I, I took a clover leaf here and just ran the highway eventually through the rest of the city and just made a kind of a complex interchange down here. But the service exchanges, one thing I have used is these service exchanges. 
And on, let me see, if we, we'll place this someplace. Just go over here. I've got this on my other map. And you can get rid of the the uh, vanilla thing that comes to enter, enter in. You can get some of these service interchanges where the highway can go through. And then you've got your road connecting to both sides of the map. And that those work really nice too. I would recommend a Yumbles channel. Y U M B L on YouTube. Twitch does a fantastic job with making different highways and different ways of starting a map. Uh, Overcharge Egg has a lot of good beginning stuff too. leave that there we'll come back if you have to but there are a lot of other highway exchanges those guys are you know some of the bigger uh, youtube guys really do have some good information there's a lot of different kinds of uh you know changes you can use depending on how much space you want to use obviously it's all gumped up because of the height that's another nice one. If you want to take your sort of like a clover leaf, I think it's called turbine. This is, I was going to put this instead of that uh, clover leaf in mine, but I did not. I, I went with the clover leaf. It, it, it just worked. That's fun to practice, too. I mean, there's no. Real wrong or right way. We have the look at this. Wow, look at that. A Fina Fox Scenic Byway. That's pretty nice. I should put that on the uh, workshop. People would think, wow, that's a nice looking road. Kind of looking to make sure the airport's working good. Oh, we're in move. Well, we were up to three before, but it's. We'll be back to that because I had to redo the the limit, the, the the area that limit. Sometimes I say words that I don't know what I'm saying. Remember, I'm over fifty. I'm married. I have four kids, so sometimes I have absolutely no idea what I'm talking. Lots of airfield aircraft flying around. Oh, yes, our science center now has no water. A service interchange. Is that what I... You know, I, I think I've seen Fina Fox in here enough. I'm going to give her moderator duty. <laughs> if she ever feels like posting something she can and if she does poorly then I'll take it off we've got a couple of them here this is a nice one uh, if you, there, this these are what they call service interchanges I think they kind of are better for taking your highway and converting it into the roads, your city roads. So they'll get your highway connections here and then you can do your roads connection here and there into the city. System interchanges. <laughs> More qualified than I am. System interchanges are the ones, well, that don't look like that. Better. This is a system interchange where it's got the connection to the highways on both sides. 
<laughs> and sometimes you can take, you know, a part of it, put it in and delete the rest of it, and you can get a, a cool connection if you want to have that. But service is an interchange type that you want to bring your sit your traffic into the city, and system is connecting two different highways. So yeah, pretty good stuff. I want to use this one here. I want to put that in in this area someplace because we'll. I think that'll be a good place to transfer this highway traffic down to the rest of the map because we'll be able to go over here and all that stuff as long as I don't break the city this is the top secret science area no one can see that Looks like we're going to have to put some water down there. There we go. Water. Yeah, they don't even get power. They're supposed to have their own power, but we'll do something fun with that in the past. In the future, maybe. Or the past. I don't know. All right. So I think when we look at this city in the in the uh, in the nighttime at some point, it's going to look pretty cool. So I think having the science center. What is possibly here? Is it the road type? Don't they like that kind of road type? Because I don't see anything else there. Darn computers. I think it will. We'll, we'll get... Get a look at that. That'll look pretty cool. Yes, it will. The tram looks fine there. Let's do... Let's just do a... I think we're going to get a little bit... Well, I don't know what I want to do. Because I want that building. Let's just find a road to place it on and see if it's... There's a couple weird buildings that have been not wanting to place where I want them to. Yeah. That's possibly because that's a highway. Let's see if we can fit this. Yeah, it works there. We get lost. We don't even know where we are. Yeah, I think maybe you're right that the, the the weirdness of the road might do it. I thank you very much. There we go. There we go. Well, I think we're going to have to... 
tone it back a little bit. I do want that main main connection there. Not as smooth as it was. Ah, uh, yes, it's a, uh, it's road color. No oh, item. I have it. I had it, but it's not updated for. For this, I actually have it unsubscribed right now. I believe that it is not updated for to work with the DLC. But it's road color. I don't remember the name. <laughs> Sorry. I do know what you're talking about. But I... I wish I remember. There. That's a little bit smoother. All right, let's give this some additional roads. And let's see if we can put our science. We might not be able to put our science center there. We can put our science center right there. Or whatever that one is I wanted to do there. Yeah, road options. Yes, exactly. That is the exact. Stadium, Theater of Wonders. I think the art museum down here would be pretty good. Let's see if we can get that to, to work for us down here. We do need a couple extra roads in this area. You can't you can't just have like one road. There. Maybe the art place will go right there. Come on, art people. It's going to cut into there, won't it? Yeah, sometimes you have to just, yeah, just do it. And now, because I think I want it to be I think it'll look better like that. There. We've got our expo center, our art museum. I I did like it. I mean, I did like the uh, airport DLC. It adds a different thing to it. I didn't do a lot with airports before, but obviously I did it. Now it's more modular and built into the game with, without having to do a lot of mod stuff. But there were airport functions before. I mean, you, you, you have other... If you want to build an airport you can still build an airport without that that uh without that
but it you know it's it's kind of fun to put the other DLCs in there. I think what they should have done one thing that I would I would have said they missed, and there might be others, is you have the fuel. You have the fuel trucks. You have the fuel, and you have the oil industry. They should have made. Uh, uh, Made it so you could supply your own fuel to the airport. You know, you could. You have a refi a refinery that exports uh, products. You could be supplying your own fuel. So, at my airports, I've I've been putting fuel storage, so I get you know kind of the realism of of fuel trucks coming to the airport. But so far, that's the one thing that I've seen. That I think would be cool. So if you're here more than once, you'll hear me say that too many times. And why do I think that? So we've got our, our aquarium here, right? We've got the aquarium, the science center. I think what I do. I want to get a nice, a nice, nice looking quay down here, like like a nice rock one. But that those I don't like these real tiny buildings. I hate them. I think we're gonna put a couple sunken plazas on each side of this. That'll look cool. Now I, yeah, Science Center Scenic Drive. Can we name this one? I don't think we can name this one, can we? Applegate Avenue. There we go. Can't even see it. Oh yeah, that's gonna look pretty good, I think. We've gotten some pretty good building going on. I like the fact that the, the freight train goes right through downtown. <laughs> that's my that's my gift to the world of city planning. Oh, see inside see this thing's not that big, but you know that thing really needs to be bigger. But it could fit down here. We could it could be a good addition to here. I'm not going to put it right there, but we have a theater of wonders. I guess this is possibly going to be our cultural, uh, our cultural place. Yeah, we do have a few more buildings we could place within the within the city. That would be nice if it fit right there. There. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we got kind of. I would agree. I think uh, that needs a district, maybe. Because we can do tourism, right? And then we can paint that district. I think this whole area could be painted as a tourism district. You know, sometimes you just want to keep the tourists down by the tourist stuff. See and science skyscraper. I'm going to put 
you. Over here. You're not that big of a building, but you're not too small. Now, another another YouTube thing here. We're at nine likes. I like round numbers. Maybe we can get to ten. How do you? What do you think? <laughs> if we get to ten, we'll be happy. We're, we're happy now too. Don't don't get me wrong. One World Trade Center. We did get that, so I I don't mind having that in my my build. I think that could possibly fit right down here oh thank you we got 11 look at that now we have one world trade center there we go that's gonna be man it, we could really have a lot of fun placing buildings can't we? our city is gonna look kind of legit at some point As we go through, oh, that Central Park thing, that, that's something we forgot completely about, didn't we? I think there's more buildings that we did not put in here. Oh, yes. Got to put this one back in. Nice and skinny for, I think that'll be a good building for there. I do like the freight train going right through downtown. It is it does make me happy. Some people might call that bad planning, but I call that good use of land. Yeah. We get some buildings right next to the little mix of new and old Lincoln building where can we put the Lincoln building can we fit the Lincoln building in there I think that's too too small. Lincoln Building is probably going to have to go out back. Too. Or not. Well, I think we'll leave it as that right now. And come back over here and see if we can find some hotels. Touristy stuff. Yeah. Gotta have the good stuff with the bad. So the tourist stuff is going to give us more... I think I know there are hotels. Let me just type in hotel. That says hotel. I have some hotels over here. So I'm going to put one here. 
going to fill in a little bit here. Get a little bit of touristy stuff over here. Fill in some buildings. We're going to have to find some nice hotels for here. This probably won't get any hotels right in here. Because we're going to find some other really cool stuff. Let's put... Should we put our opera house back here? Or is that too much? Are we Sydney? Are we going to be like Sydney? Because right, I'm going to, I want to try and generate comments on our, my videos. So if someone thinks that's too much and you got this far in the video, say yes to the Opera House or no to the Opera House in the comments. Not in the chat, but in the comments. That means you got to come back and put a comment. Because comments apparently help the YouTube algorithm also. I'm not going to say what I think, but uh, I think that is such and such. Now we don't really, I can't really find. <clears throat> Not good at finding the uh, the things we want. Ooh, there's a hotel. Rich Carlton. Oh, that, I I'd like a comment. I don't get very many comments in videos, so we'll we'll be very happy. Hmm. I think a, a hotel here would be. Let's see if we can trick the game. Putting a hotel here. Did it look like the game just kind of sank there for a minute? We could put this hotel here and then move it. Ah. Ah, uh, we're going to trick it. I think that'll be a kind of a cool place for a hotel. Rich Carlton. Well, that, that, and if you don't, don't, don't worry. I mean, no one will die if we don't, right? <laughs> uh oh, we did sever a power line. Wish that power would just kind of. Yeah, I like that one. It's kind of nice there. And then you can look out over there. You're close. You're close to the cruise ships. And that's where we're gonna have to build a nice marina too. I think. What else can we put down here? I think we can probably get away with some of these, these residences like this. Ooh. Hudson Yards. Yeah, I've got Hudson Yards buildings. I don't know if you've... Maybe we'll do Hudson Yards buildings down here. Yeah. 
don't know if you're familiar with Hudson Yards. It's it's a building project in New York, like to create a new neighborhood. I think that one looks pretty good there. That's one of my mixed use buildings that doesn't want to work properly. There. Oh, we are having a a good stream today. I'm enjoying enjoying this. Nice to Yeah, these these are really nice assets too, the cosmopolitan. Uh Condo assets. We need to put some there. All right, we better save the game before something horrible goes wrong. Well, I've been streaming for almost two hours. So what I'm going to do right now, because I'm enjoying this, is I'm going to go take a, a break. And we'll leave the game running here, I guess. We'll put it on day night cycle. How's that sound? Let's see if we can get some nighttime while I am gone. See how this part starts looking. So I think uh, two hours is good for a break. So I'll be back, refill my coffee, and I can't guarantee how long we'll go afterwards, but we'll do it for at least. A half an hour after I get back. So I'll be back shortly.
All right, I'm back. Did we get, oh, we get nighttime now, I think? Did we get any nighttime? Looks like we're starting to. Hello, I'm back. I... Looks like it's getting a little darker, so we'll 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 let that we'll let that work into the darkness. Take a quick look around the city, make sure it doesn't burn down. I think we'll, we'll do something like this, hey? Check some of our stats. Not bad. 69% traffic flow with a city of 102,000. Can't complain about that. Oop. And then power's good. That's all good. Land value. Well, you'd think that land value there would be pretty. Maybe we're really screwing up the land value with the train. But, oh, yeah, look at that. That's looking pretty good. We gotta get a shot of that. Ooh, that's a nice shot too. I didn't think I'd get a city to look good like this. The train is worthless. No, it is not as, it's good. We've got a lot of really cool areas. Fill up the computer. All that. This is the eco area. This is the eco center. That's even a pretty nice one. Uh oh. Looks like ah, uh, you know, you know, we're probably running into power problems because it's nighttime. We don't go at nighttime that often. Let's see what the city looks like from inside. Well, thank you. I think we did. I think we all did pretty good so far on this. Let's give that a save because we do that. Go back to options. Give us some light. Build. There we go. Back to the daytime. We've got a lot of commercial demand too, so. We need a lot of uh, detailing down here. And I have an idea, but I might do it off, save a different game and do it. Uh, we were in here. <laughs> I, think, <laughs> I think they would be quite large, wouldn't they? Uh, we're going to do a little bit of extra landscaping. And it looks like we need a little bit of room here. Not a lot. That might be good. Maybe we can put some of these condos and stuff in here. Cannot build on water. I guess some of that needs to unflood. There. 
There's some. Oh, we got prop anarchy on. Shift P. Let's redo those. back we'll do that one right there we had tucked this one in the corner here I think that one there there then we'll we'll do some detailing between them because we don't really want them too close we do have some hotels and stuff over here. I was thinking, just doing some pathways. <clears throat> Actually, I'd like to do. I want to see how this looks. No, well, I guess there is shoreline there, but. It's an industrial one. I don't know if I want an industrial one in there. I don't have a lot of quays. Ah, think about putting a, I do, I do have some, so we will put some of those in there. Uh, I was gonna start with a bicycle, just do a small bicycle path down here. Cause we don't have much bicycle stuff. We might not be thinking about our bicycle friends that much. And this would be a good place. Yeah, I, 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 I agree. I do have a, some of them. Put a fish factory down there. Brilliant. That is way over saying it. You may need to do some movement. We can get one of them in there. There. Not necessarily going to be that pretty, but we will need so we will need parking, and there's plenty of parking like that everywhere. So we got bike people biking right away. They they're like, ah, oh, we need bike paths. Put some of our purple flower trees down here. Can't do too much there. I really like the live oaks. We'll do small clusters because we might want to fill in something else within there. I think around the hotel type thing we can do more here. Something like that maybe. Well, I did do this series primarily by the books. I did add in this mod apply for grant when we did the airport. So I did cheat a little bit, but overall, budget wise, we are taking in 607,000 and we're spending 529,000. So in general, we are, we are a profitable city and I'm trying to keep it at that. 
I did cheat a little bit for for the the airport, but I did for the most of the series stay within within the budget. Yeah, and we have we have we do have five star industries. We have all the parking, or all the well, not parking factories. So we got we have the car factory, we have the coaling factory, which does produce materials. We just every once in a while they don't have enough. Sneaker factory, electronics factory, lemonade, steel. It did that all in the center. Because that wasn't a big part of the city at that time, and we are also I've I've got the uh, modular house factory over here with the soft paper mill, pulp mill, a couple pulp mills, and then got the farming industry. I think is making profits and. The quarry industry is making profits. And then another oil industry area is making profits here and there. And I think our airport is making a lot. It, it was making a lot of profits. Yeah, it's it's making profits more again, 31,000. So we're making 6,000 or something there. But yeah, we're trying to uh, stay profitable. That's why I call the series by the books. Just because I, I wanted to do this one. Well, what I did <laughs> is I primarily did, once I unlocked it, I had oil tank, oil stuff, but I have the geothermal power plants. I have the incineration plants for garbage. And then I have, I did put a nuclear power plant down here. So once I was able to, I did go through and unlock all the, everything through the game. And then once we got to the last milestone, I put 81 tiles and unlocked that. And pretty much trying to unlock everything now. Because I went through all the progressions and now I just want to build the city uh, kind of nice. So let's run that, let's run that bicycle path. And by, by no means uh, am I an expert. <laughs> and occasionally we have the windmills. We plopped windmills in. When we needed power in extra areas when we expanded. And I don't think we need those anymore. Well, you know, maybe we do. It's hard to believe that this, I've been working. I've been doing this city probably since what, December, maybe. One thing you do notice is that your your citizens will do a lot of biking. But we have a lot of those kinds of fun things we can add in. And they will walk miles and miles. It's crazy. So we should probably add in that. Let's see, what mod? I don't know if that's a mod. Oh, you know what? I think it's part... I could be wrong. These... Uh, the bike one is after dark. And the other ones are park life. And campus stuff. So park life and campus... And bicycles were after dark. I think that's what that was. I think that's... Yeah, after dark DLC.
we can fit a path along here. It's not a road, we want a path. I'd connect to the road above too. I think I did. I don't know if I'd be able to get into there. And maybe above too, yeah. We could go this way. Yeah, let's do the bike here. That's going to be fun right there, isn't it? Yes, they do. We're also going to do a path. Look at this. A lot of traffic down here. You know, we should probably fix that some way. I don't know why we're getting dump trucks down here. Maybe we have to restrict some of that. I think I would put a trade school path. Actually, what we probably need is one of those quays with paths. Yeah, <laughs> they're going up it. They're using it. There was some seriously, serious pent-up demand for bikes. Oh, I don't know. I don't know if I want to put a roundabout in. That whole area probably needs a lot of, a lot of work. We have two ports there for Colossal Lines. This would be a neat place. Well, We'll leave that. I don't think I have a quay path. I think I have to get one of those. That's what we that's what we'll put in there. I wonder if I can. There's a couple of things I would like to do with put in the uh thinking is commercial small commercial <clears throat> How to do to do Actually, what I need is a small road there. No, I don't. Uh, I had a problem with... I end up with sometimes... I had a problem with way too many garbage trucks. At one point, it was crazy. I had to really just mess around. At one point, this was really ugly. And I had all my garbage services along here. And the garbage trucks would just kind of circle around in here. Just I had like 200 garbage trucks just going up and down and up and down. It's just oh, it was bad. Now, sometimes they get into some weird, weird stuff they want to do. I want, I want a, I want a road. Yeah, 
Yeah. No, I don't want to quit. I take this. I don't think I can do it. I am not an expert on policies yet. I've policies are I think I would be bad in giving you any expert expertise on that. <laughs> I don't I apologize, but I, I don't think I'd Qualified to give it. Oh, here's River Quay Walks. Let's see what this does. Let's see. Yeah, if someone else has a acclaimed, we're doing good in our university that we never pay any t attention to. I should probably do something with the uh, policies. I have some out there. I did do stuff with the there. Now we have to do a little, little landscaping. I think. I did some of that in the organic district. Yeah. You don't want to work. Yeah, the forgotten university is thriving. It's just it's just there. It's just there. So I would kind of I thought we were talking about like the touristy stuff. I think I have to put a road. <laughs> I at one time had a cobblestone road thing. I think what we'll do this. We're going to go in. I don't know if this is going to work. And what we can do is we can go into, I think, vehicle restrictions. Ban cars, buses, you can't ban trucks. That garbage. Well, no, I don't want to ban all vehicle restrictions. So I thought there was like a path that you could do something like this in. But I want to go in here and just do some. See if we get any. Ooh, what was that? Look at that. We have more offices and buildings we can choose from. But I want to go in here and put some. A small tourist district. Just uh
some clubs and restaurants for people. Since they're small. Kind of mix them up. Brewtown Pub, you know, something like that right on the corner here. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to. I guess we'll just move. Just leave it as a small district, people. But I thought I thought you could do it as like a path. We'll have to look. I like the little brew town there. Just a, a place people can come down and hang out. Get in trouble. Nothing big. Maybe there's a small seedy motel down here or something. I'll look it up. I actually, I, I, I thought of the idea. A paved pedestrian walk fastly where cars cannot go. Cars cannot go. Cars cannot go. Paved pedestrian path. Nice. I'll look it up. I, I saw Overcharge Egg doing it in his campus, and that's where I thought of the idea for this. So maybe I'll maybe we'll have to build it and then change it. I think I could do my zoning thing. Oh. Yeah, no... We could do this. I don't want to mess with that. That could be problematic. Problematic. That'd be a good place. To, well, we'll just put a path on the back. Say we tried. Do a little move it on that. I know there's snapping and stuff like that too. The more I do this, the more I'll possibly figure some of that out. Little walk down there, they could go check out the river. And if you're watching and enjoying, we'll do the YouTube spiel. <laughs> I would appreciate a like or even subscriptions are nice. I won't say it too much. I don't say it too much. Can I upgrade? Oh, I don't want to upgrade. Have under, okay, let's take a look. Roads. Yeah, I'm probably missing it someplace.
Probably to a highway ramp. That's a nice road. I wonder what that looks like. That's a good road for that, too. Maybe. Let's see what that road looks like on here. Not the same thing as you're probably talking about. But it's more of that, uh, more like I'm looking for. Well, we'll just do that. If we restrict that one, that would have been pretty cool. I'll throw some more trees. Sorry if I'm using all live oaks, but uh, kind of like them right now. And if you're using vanilla trees, then you're really saving some potential assets and stuff. I think that looks a lot better than it did. It's not. Perfect. Maybe we can make that another uh, tourism district. Yeah, let's do it. Let's see if it helps. Oh, we we kind of we kind of did already. <clears throat> okay. I will have to check that out. Well, not perfect. Not. Fantastic, but works. I think we did very well with our our downtown project. Do need some buildings to fill in there. We did have some more that we could put in. Ooh. We'll have to do some some ground level. Zion's bank building. I can fill in some of them gaps. We got Northwestern Mutual Tall. Oh well, yeah, that's a that's a Milwaukee one. Who in downtown? I have. I think I have mostly the 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 live oaks now. And the purple ones and most of them are most of all the trees I have in in this area and in the park are the, the vanilla DLC one the new DLC one we need a place for you this obviously this is uh this needs a path this needs to be a park we'll have to make a park out of that I like the mix there. I don't like all these little buildings here, but we can come back and fix that. But, oh. And this is really a big park back here. Something that could be worked on. This is an okay area. We did that, we planned that. Maybe we can maybe we can bring the Northwestern Mutual Tower. Sorry, guys. But uh, I think we want to put that there. No. 
We don't have enough room for you. Well, maybe we get some smaller, fancier buildings. Here. That Prague office. You're not really occupied. You think you are, but you're not. I don't think we need three or four three or four three three or maybe four dollar stores downtown. <clears throat> Can we fit I bet if we move the, no we, we tried this one already we didn't. We should be able to we just put that in. That might be a nice building there, but we don't want it, doesn't want to fit for us. Need something with a nice square. There. There you go. Uh, it's not necessarily a mod, Rick. Uh, you go, have you gone into the, the workshop yet? A lot of these big buildings are unique buildings. And then... Oh, I'm sorry. I thought you were talking about the buildings. Hi. Now, 81 tiles or 20, 25 tiles. I guess since we reclaimed some of this land out here, we might end up building out there. But since we really did go nice and fancy over here, we're probably going to have to revamp some of this in, in a future episode. But I think that looks pretty good. We'll have to do some prettying, prettying up here. Uh, we should probably put a tram line in, shouldn't we? Probably put a tram line in. But the problem is that we did not give the tram a place to turn around down here. And that's what we probably need to do. Can't give the tram if we don't give it a two lane road tram tracks. So we can give. Basically, that as an area to for the trams to turn around. And let's give the tram a a line. So we do have tram, tram, tram. We're going to give the tram a, a stop here. Uh, I think we'll give the tram a stop by the hotel. By that. We'll give it a stop right right. You now. Give too many stops. We'll give it here, then people can go there. There. And then it'll come around. Sorry about the janky work there. And we'll just start with that. Ooh, let's do another one. Tram will 
want to create a new line. Yeah, we can we can we'll start the line here. We give our our tram stop here. Back to our metro. Over Yeah, it'll go over to here and then come back. So we get a couple tram lines. Uh, it is apply for a grant. So we can actually go in and look at that. Look at the mods. I think it's. I don't know why it doesn't show it on here, but I think if you type in apply for a grant, ooh, unlock after dark. I don't want those here. Oh yeah, we want to do concerts too. Yeah, this doesn't show up in there, but I think it is apply for a grant. To be honest, well, I do believe that this worked out pretty well. The city down here is looking pretty good. We got a lot of detailing down here to do. I don't think so. No, it's it's just like, it's like, uh, yeah, you don't have to pay it back. That's the answer. You do not have to pay it back. <laughs> I have a lot of these like little districts like this that propped up for This could be this could be better down here and we could always possibly do that. Free money. Yeah, that's why I got that one. If you get to the point where yeah, you know, I need a few dollars. You can you can do it. And you don't you know, you can if you don't wanna do that kind of thing. Yeah, downtown has some scale to it now. And we have a lot of little areas like that that need uh, some fancying up. And we'll do all this fancying up of some of these areas that we already have. And then we'll, we'll move on to new areas because this is going to be a whole nother skyline that we can we can have. Oh yeah, it's gonna. I, hopefully, it'll get big. We'd like to like to continue this city as long as we can. So I'm gonna work on this one and my Riverton city. Be quite sprawling by the time we're done. And I gotta be careful because I I can only put so many assets into the game. But with that, I think I will. Appreciate and a thank everyone who has been here. Uh, ask for a like, maybe a comment at some point. And even uh, if you like what you're seeing, I'll be back. I try to, I'm going to commit to at least uh, three or four days of streaming a week. So they will either be at around 3.30 in the afternoon. Or they will be after that, after 6 central time. And then on Fridays and Saturdays and Sundays, it can be it can be random. But I'm thinking Friday, on Fridays it will probably be in the morning, nine o'clock in the morning, a.m. 
because I have Fridays off. So, yeah, we'll we'll do good, and uh, hopefully we can build up the, the channel. And once I can put community posts on this one, I will. So, appreciate everyone for coming along, and especially coming back. That's that's kind of it's kind of nice. At our nice train station, I I think this was a good a good fit. These are probably very very pricey places. But uh, you guys take care and have a good day.